blameless as a child. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. This is Father Angel with the Orthodox Church. Welcome to the Gospel for December 23rd, 2020, according to St. Mark. He said to them, Whoever divorces his wife and marries another commits adultery against her. And if she divorces her husband and marries another, she commits adultery. People were bringing little children to him in order that he might touch them. And the disciples spoke sternly to them. But when Jesus saw this, he was indignant and said to them, Let the little children come to me, and do not stop them, for it is to such as these that the kingdom of God belongs. Truly I tell you, whoever does not receive the kingdom of God as a little child will never enter it. And he took them up in his arms, laid his hands on them, and blessed them. Glory be to thee, O God. Glory be to thee. The Christ loves the children. God loves the children. He truly loves them. They are lovable, really. And sometimes when we think about God, it is easy for us to, to, follow into, to fall into the temptation of thinking that this is a, a serious matter, that God is, is stern, that He is a, a, a difficult person, that we have to be uh, in such and such and such ways, but it's not the truth. In reality, God is very simple and loving. And he would rather have us as children and as little child. Because if we become not as a child, then we will not enter into, into heaven. Why is that? Because the children are innocent. They have no malice. They are not making calculations or taking advantage of. They are simple. The younger they are, the simpler they are. We learn to be uh, speculative and interested as we grow up. But when we are children, when we are small, we are simple. And we have to simply love God. We have to take care of our children too. Of the children that God has entrusted us. We see how the Gospel starts reminding us how we commit adultery. And we have to repent. And even if in some time of your life you were married and you had a, the worst of uh, spouses, either a wife or a husband, and you divorced or were left by him, still you have to repent of the adultery if you remarried. Repent of the adultery and pray to God that he will make you to become faithful to God that you might really take care of your children that are God's children, that we might also, in time, become simple, honest, and blameless by the action of the Holy Spirit. For blessed is our God, always, now, and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen.